Getting healthy, losing weight, or addressing things like trouble sleeping or chronic pain can seem really overwhelming and confusing. But one of the best ways that we can kind of gain an edge on reaching our health goals is to use at-home lab testing to kind of take a look inside of our bodies. So in this video, I wanna tell you about everlywell.com. They offer a huge variety of different lab tests. They're extremely easy to select the tests you want. Then they send you literally everything that you need to do your lab test at home. And they even send you the box and the pre-postage stamped envelope to send your results off. Then within a couple of days, you receive an email. And once you sign in to your dashboard on Everly Well, you can see all of your different results. You can see the doctor's recommendations based on your results. And it even gives you all these awesome options to uh, print off your lab results or even print a copy of the results for your doctor. So the three tests I did were food sensitivity, metabolism test, and vitamin D and inflammation. So I think that a food sensitivity test is one of the best tools to have uh, pretty much for everyone. So it actually tests for 95 different foods, and then it shows you uh, where your immune response falls for each of those food, kind of putting them into four different categories. So determining if you have food sensitivities or what foods you might be sensitive to is going to help you determine things like uh, what could be the source of headaches, source of pain, source of allergy symptoms, or if you're trying to lose weight and you feel that no matter what you're doing, you can't lose weight, uh, again, this would be a great test to help you determine if maybe there's a food you're eating that your body doesn't like. So I was really happy that my food sensitivity test came back. Uh, I didn't have any um, high or mild reactions. So even though I don't have any strong food sensitivities, which I'm very thankful for, I can still use this information to tweak and improve my diet and just try to reduce my consumption of some of those foods that now I know I do have a slight sensitivity to. The next test I took was the metabolism test. So it measures your cortisol, which is one of your main stress hormones. It also measures free testosterone and thyroid stimulating hormone. So I actually had a relatively high TSH level. And what that means is that I actually have low thyroid function. Um, so the body will create more thyroid stimulating hormone when you are in a hypothyroid state or not enough thyroid hormone. So even though this number is still considered within the normal range, uh, this does kind of tell me that I'm having some low thyroid function and this would be something that I need to work on. Also, if I look at my testosterone level, it's actually out of range, it's ultra low. So even though we typically think of testosterone as kind of a male hormone, it's actually really, really important in women as well. Regulating things like your energy levels, your libido, and even when it comes to your body composition, your body's ability to burn fat and build muscle, testosterone plays a big part in that. Um, so this was a big, big eye-opener for me to know that I need to probably work on ways to boost my testosterone level, probably need to look at that thyroid hormone as well, uh, but I was thrilled that my cortisol is just below the normal level. So I was worried that I'd have really high cortisol because I'm I'm a little bit stressed out from time to time. Uh, so that one actually made me a lot, feel a lot better to see that. And this is a great test for people that are trying to lose weight or struggling with losing weight. The third test I did was this vitamin D and inflammation. So inflammation is part of the body's immune response. Anytime you get a scratch or a scrape, inflammation is that kind of red puffiness that literally is your body's immune system coming in to heal and repair. So inflammation is a great thing. I just kind of wanted to check in and see where I fell there. Uh, but this is a really important thing to consider. Any type of inflammatory condition you might have, 
So anything ending with itis, all right? Arthritis, colitis, there's a lot of different things, right? Any of those conditions that end with ITIS, that's an inflammatory condition. And so uh, a test like this can be very, very useful if you have one of those conditions uh, to just see where your inflammation levels lie. And then if you were to alter your diet and lifestyle, you could then do the test again to see if it helped. So again, I was really relieved to see my results here. Uh, they use something called C-reactive protein to, uh, as a marker of inflammation to determine your level of inflammation. And my C-reactive protein was extremely, extremely low. However, I was a little bit alarmed because my vitamin D levels um, are just slightly insufficient. So I feel like I'm someone that gets a lot of sun exposure, so I was actually really surprised to see how low my vitamin D levels were. Now granted, we are just kind of right at the cusp of springtime, so I'm not getting as much sun exposure as I will be in like two or three months from now. Uh, so this was really interesting to me, and I've actually started taking a little vitamin D supplement to try to increase my vitamin D levels a little bit. So I was just really pleased to see all the detail that they give you with your results. And even for each of the markers that they test, if you click on that marker, it will go to an even more detailed description of problems that you know, those levels might indicate suggestions for you to do. Uh, so I just found everything about this process super helpful and really, really educational. Um, and then of course, as an added bonus, you can take this information to your doctor, your doctor of functional medicine, and they can, you know, get such a great insight from seeing these different levels, these different lab results, uh, and really helping you get to the bottom of whatever your health issue or whatever is preventing you from losing weight, etc. So now I want to take a look at some of the other tests offered on everlywell.com. Probably if I could have done a fourth test, the fourth test I would have wanted to do is the HbA1c. So this is a test that they use to determine uh, basically where your blood sugar metabolism is at. So this is the test that they use to determine if someone is pre-diabetic or on their way to diabetes. Um, I think anyone that has a lot of sugar cravings or dips in energy throughout the day. Um, this would be a great test to do, certainly for anybody with a history of diabetes in their family, just to kind of get an idea. Are you eating too much sugar? And maybe more importantly, how efficient is your body at breaking down that sugar? And so the HbA1c is a great test to do. There's also a general heart health test um, it also checks this HbA1c marker. In addition to cholesterol levels, again, that C-reactive protein, which is an indicator of inflammation in the body. Uh, so a really way to just get a kind of overview, the health of your heart, the health of your body. There's also a sleep and stress test. So this is a really cool test. It looks at things like your melatonin levels, your cortisol levels, and essentially that's going to be, I mean, that's kind of obvious, right? It's gonna help you with sleep issues and stress problems. Um, but again, because sleep is kind of at the center of all of these different problems we can have in our body, I think this would be a great test for just about anyone. Uh, just to kind of see not only how much you're sleeping, but it's gonna help you see how well you're sleeping, uh, what the quality of your sleep is. So again, whether you're talking about weight loss, the primary time your body metabolizes fat is while you're asleep. So if you're struggling with losing weight, this would be a great test to do and see if maybe something as simple as sleep could be the key to figuring out your, your weight loss struggles. Things like stress levels, everything from headaches to pain, et cetera, um, are all gonna be able to come back to this element of cortisol levels and how well you're sleeping. Uh, so that's a wonderful, wonderful test for a lot of different applications. There are also a variety of tests for cholesterol and lipid levels. 
There's even a thyroid specific test, which honestly, after seeing my kind of high level of TSH, I'm probably gonna order the thyroid test so I can get even a more clear picture of exactly what's going on with my body. There's also a variety of fertility tests, sexual health tests, both for men and for women, um, and just so many different tests to help you take control of your health, get to the bottom of your health issues, and determine the answers or the solutions that are really gonna help you get to that next level. So I wanna give you another little look at all of the awesome things that you receive when you order your test. I really feel like this takes the hassle out of lab testing. Because if you've had lab tests done in the past, uh, you know that oftentimes it involves going to your doctor, finding a lab, going to the lab, going back to the doctor. It's just kind of a lot. Uh, and you can see where something like this just takes all of that traveling, all of those appointments out of the equation, so to speak, uh, so that you can get the information much quicker, much more easily, uh, and a lot more cost effective as well. Thank you so much for watching this video and a big thanks to Everly Well. I love they send you even this little cute little Band-Aid holder. It's really opened up my eyes a lot to things that I didn't even know I had going on. So I know that it can help you out and I hope that you will uh, check out all the links in the description and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. We at Wellness Plus specialize in all things health and wellness ranging from yoga and fitness to massage and ASMR. Whether you are looking to target specific areas of tension or want to enhance your general self-care routine, we provide the tools you need to feel better, look better, and live better. We have courses for every level, whether you're just starting out or you're a seasoned pro. Our courses provide a wide range in difficulty to accommodate your evolving flow. Welcome back to Yoga with Jess. We are going to break down some really essential postures. We are going to rock out with some of the most essential ab exercises that you need to have the abs that you've always dreamed of. I've blended techniques to help you connect with students and you can be a rock star teacher. Wellness Plus is available on Amazon, which you can stream from your home on your phone, tablet, or TV. Join Wellness Plus today and get your first seven days free.